So where we left off, we had to... That's trippy. We left off, we had to clear uh, this area. It was pretty intense. I'm just going to see if we left anything on the ground. Played the Resident Evil 3 demo on PS4 today. Oh boy, you're going to be in for some stress. Oh, really? The demo's out. That's cool, Glotz. Is it basically the same as... Ooh, nice. Is it basically the same as Resident Evil 2? Okay. There's actually a bunch of stuff around here, so... Let's see if there's anything on this right side. Somebody made a Doom mod like the DD Houndmasters mod. He could play as himself. Yeah, that would be cool. Oh, Baginator. Bro, I really hope that you're okay, man. That sounds really bad. I don't see any other pickups. Uh, maybe these rockets? No, we're all full. Okay. So we got the rocket launcher. We have the plasma gun. We've got the, the sniper shot now. And then my favorite, Black Beauty. What's up, Albino? Welcome. There's been improvements in Resident Evil 2? Oh, yeah? Okay, cool. I'm excited. Very excited. Uh, we've got a fr uh, free life above us. I'm happy about the unlocks that we've picked to show us the entire uh, map and all the secrets. What's that? Whoa! Yeah, was he doing that before? That looks like a fresh new attack. Hey, Sentinel battery. I don't know if they've been launching like that. How am I going to get up there? <laughs> Black Beauty, is that the super shoddy? I don't have the super shoddy yet. No, not quite. Oh, there we go. Whoa. Okay, what's the trick there? What are we missing? That's definitely the way up. Yeah, it is quiet. You know what that means. Okay, so if I... Even if I get up to there, then what? Oh, I wonder if I could grip this? So maybe I could somehow get from there to this one to that? How's Walter? Walter's doing good, Aninda. Oh, so close! Do you guys see an alternate way that I could try to get that that life up there? I don't think I can reach this. It looks grabbable. Yeah, I don't know. I'm trying to see if there's any, like, uh, grapple points. Doesn't seem to be. And I can't reach that. Maybe we come maybe we come back out here at some point or something. There's there's got to be something. We'll 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 keep our eyes on it. Your salvation lies in his destruction. Maybe the first monkey bar is a decoy. It absolutely could be. Exposed now to us. Can you see it, brothers? Hey, Miro. He has lost the result to continue. Eat his soul. Whoa. I must survive this. Protect me in my time of need, and you will secure your place in the new world. Oh boy. What do we do? Do we kill him? I think we take him out. Try to preserve ammo. You hear that little? <gasps> Hold on. Oh no, never mind. Yeah, you hear that little noise there when their head pops off? Wait, what? Oh. 
Oh, cool. I guess that was like a th that was a thing. It's like when you do one, I can't do that noise, but you know the uh, when people do something like that, they can like make a pop sound. Stuff below us. Hold up. Okay. Maybe I can't get there yet. Cool. Your super shotgun is nearby. Oh! From your past, the priests have kept it hidden from you in this remote location. Now we're talking. What a tease. Whoa. What the? <laughs> oh, no. Look what it is. I don't want to see those. Well, I guess we're just jumping down here. Look at this. Whoa. Cue balls are ambient demons that wander the world. Shooting them sends them flying. When they collide with other demons, they generate a bigger explosion and do extra damage? What a cool name. Cue balls. The Slayer is inside the facility. Please proceed with aggression. Yeah, I remember. I can't hit these things on the ground, I guess. My god. Oh. <laughs> okay. Okay. This is a very tight spot. Very tight. It's toit. Okay, so these things are like... We should keep these guys alive. Yeah, that's sick. Okay. We'll keep these guys alive. Okay. Here we go. Up oh, hold up. Oh, the sound is happening. The sound is happening, but oh, I got I got I got to do one thing. I got to do one thing. I know what it is. One sec. Okay, this should fix it. My bad. My bad. Double dings. There we go. Okay. We're up to 60. That's correct, I believe. 
Uh, where did chat go? Okay. That was the problem. Now we're good. Straight up problematic. The Slayer is inside the facility. Please proceed with aggression. Oh, I shouldn't have done that. Oh, it's just like... This is going to be intense. We'll figure this out. No chance for warming up. We're just diving right in. Attention, all mortally challenged personnel. The Slayer is inside the facility. Please I'm gonna try to save this guy. Saving him did not work. Oh, he is alive. That's good. <laughs> That's actually so cool. Whoops, wrong guy. Okay, Arachno down. What? Oh, what? Not, none of my guns were firing. <laughs> Did you guys see that? <laughs> none of my guns were even firing. All right. Sleep. Whoa. Got him. I gotta stay out of these little things. Is he gone? Oh! He was just staggered. He was gone. I think we got him. Okay. Now I'm picking up what they're putting down. Oh, don't tell me we're going straight into one of these. Because I'll do it. I will do it. How am I getting in there? Whoops.
That uh, looks not safe. I could probably hit that wall. Atlakon Hoonge. <laughs> Wrongly pronounced for the 50th time. So this is the new Doom? Yeah, buddy. Yeah, buddy. Oh, I see what they're looking for here. Six and a half hours till it unlocks in Europe. Nice. I'd really like to do some uh, multiplayer stuff. Okay, Sentinel Crystal, finally. Let's think about this, because these don't come up very frequently. Uh, we have Loot Magnet, which also, which also buffed our armor potential and our ammo. I'm leaning towards... I, I really want to try to use uh, the Flame Belch a lot more. Um, I'm definitely underutilizing it. So I'm thinking maybe going, grabbing the health boost here so that the flame belch takes less time to cool down. Definitely health. 100% health. 100%. I'm with you there. Plus then this one leads into armor as well. So like, just in terms of survivability long term, I think both of these would be good. All right, awesome. So I think that's all of our challenges too. Master of Turrets is locked there. <laughs> uh, guys, we got to do it. This is going to be tough. But this is another challenge run. Oh, do I just need to kill him? Oh, sick! Okay, that wasn't... Okay, so it was just a secret encounter. It wasn't an actual, uh, like, challenge room. Cool. I will happily take that, my friends. Hey, there's things below us. It looks like we go down through here, but also there's a way up somehow. I wonder... Okay, I'm going to check this. Damn, Wakiza. Thanks, man. Ah, there we go. Wakiza, thank you so much, brother. Once again. Oh. <laughs> so generous, bro. Thank you so much, man. Hey, where are we at? We actually have... Let's take a look here. We have some upgrades. Now, we need to... We need to find that, like... Turret-looking upgrade thing to start a path we go precision bolt movement or or we maybe finish off uh not full auto hold on oh yeah this this will be nice we'll get there eventually what do you guys think would be the next good one i'm not really using full auto that much maybe i'm underutilizing it Microwave beam, I'm not sure I want to invest a whole lot more in, but the 66% reduction could be significant. Precision bolt movement. I think the reload speed, I would just save an extra one and go for that instead of the mobility. And then micro missiles is... Uh, oh, this. Kills with the heavy cannon will boost micro missiles damage by 30. And then we can get into here. Yeah, okay. Problem solved. Problem solved. 
Hit at least three enemies in a single micro-missile volley 15 times. Okay. What is this doing? It's just punching this forward, and then I can... Now, why would I want to do that, though? I think that's going to be how we get up to here. So let's figure this out. There's also these ones. Okay, so that's opening this, which lets me get to that other wall. Don't forget, we gotta go up for secrets. Yeah, that's what I'm trying to do here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, Wilson. Thanks, man. Thanks for the sub, buddy. Been watching since the original XCOM playthroughs. Thanks for the entertainment while I'm stuck at home. You're welcome, man. Okay, so that takes us up. We're locked and loaded. Oh, whoops. Well, that's gonna get me. <laughs> this is gonna get me crushed. Ugh. Oh, that extra stagger really paying off there. Okay, still behind us. Hmm. Is this going up even more? Yeah, it is. Got it. Is that the third one? I think that's this area clear, guys. Yeah, I think so. I wonder if I should be going down there now? Wow, that's tight. What's up, Peachy? Hey, Shatan. Welcome, guys. Oh, boy. Oh, puppy pets. I'll do it one second. Neural connection successful. You are now in control of the Revenant drone. You may use it to reclaim your property. What? <laughs> what? 
Twin rockets, afterburner, jetpack. Rocket barrage. Excellent. Playing as a revenant. Hold mouse 2 to use your jetpack to fly high up. Press left shift to activate afterburner to quickly dodge. If you run out of fuel, these abilities will be unable and uh, unavailable until it recharges. Press mouse 1 to fire twin rockets. Press F to launch a rocket barrage, which is a stronger attack that requires a brief windup. Can I still glory kill? Oh, no. I'm overheated. <laughs> oh. Oh, there's stuff up here. I need fuel! Whoa, whoa, whoa. Wow. These rockets feel insane. <laughs> We're definitely a jacked up version. <laughs> That's wild. I want this, like, permanently. We'd be way more survivable. I can't check the map or anything out here. Alright. That was cool. Put him back in the cage. Where can I get a remote-controlled Revenant? Only here, apparently. Farron, thank you so much, man. Just got laid off due to the coronavirus. Thank you for being... making content for me to get through times like this. Oh, bro, I feel so bad. Yep, this works. That sucks, man. I'm so massively bored, but I've been playing Battletech and XCOM to bide some time. Hopefully in two weeks I'll be back. Man, I hope so. I really hope so. I feel for you, brother. Uh, What are those two markers at the bottom? Of the screen. Are those new? Oh, there it is. The Super Shotgun Plus Meat Hook. Devastating close-range weapon that features the Meat Hook mod. When in range of a demon, press mouse 2 to pull yourself to the demon. Wow.
So I'm guessing, is this on five? No ammo. I'm gonna have to change something for sure. Oh, he's a pinball. Whoa, that was close. Oh my. I hit him the wrong way. Little bit of health here. Okay, we're getting the hang of those guys. I really need ammo. I should have torched him, my bad. I think we found ammo. Oh, you can even, like, swing. I just have no ammo. Oh, what? Like, Pathfinder? I'm not even sure if that was the guy that killed us. Let's actually chain this dude so we have everything that we might need. Wow, that's sick. Jesus! Woo! Oh, nice. And now we don't even know what's inside these ones. Come on, get there. Whoa, okay now. <sighs> Drunk opossum, hello, hi. Hello. Hello, hi. There is a monkey bar in there, trust me. I'm seeing it too and I'm like, it's tempting. Okay. Oh, you haven't missed much. We're basically just getting started. He 
He blocked it. Everything lately has been really scary. It seems like a lot at the end of the world. So I just want to say I love you all. Don't forget to breathe. And thank you for providing us with this distraction. Really enjoying Doom. Thank you. That's really kind. I think this is more just like an escape thing here. Okay, what do we open next? Oh, I'm gonna die for sure. Got stuck on the wall! Alrighty. This is the one. Oh, he's down. I wonder if I should try, like, opening another thing here, because there's still so many to go. Out of ammo, low ammo. Oh, here. Hold up. Let's try this. Oh, I didn't flame early enough. Whoops. I guess we could swing on these, like, forever. Oh, nice. Okay. <laughs> One left. Let's wait for our frost bomb to recharge. Should turn down the difficulty? No way, man. This is the challenge. If you're not into, like... If you're not into the challenge aspect, that's totally cool. I totally get it. But that's, like, the best part of this. If you're just like, if you just like stomp through, it's not, it's not fun for me anyway. Not fun for me. Oh, look at that attack that she does, though. Thank you. Oh, what? Nice. Doom is supposed to be hard. Yeah, I, I agree. I agree. But I get it for some people. They just, they just want to see, like, the, the stuff. Ooh. Ooh. Cheat codes, baby. 
IDDQD? IDDQD. Is that a reference to, uh... Was there a cheat code in, like, the first Doom? Something about IDDQD? God mode? Is that what that is, Nightmare? <clears throat> that's the original for Doom. Yeah, that's cool. Okay. Oh, man. It's so satisfying when we when we do beat it, though. It's really, really satisfying. Old Doom, con Old Doom console code code. For God mode. Okay, cool. Attention, all cultist base personnel. Please destroy the Slayer. The priest must survive. I repeat, the priest must survive. Can anybody remind me or tell me what the bottom icons are? At the bottom of the screen? Uh, I'm drinking a cold brew coffee metal. Health and armor, dash and blood punch. Dash and blood punch are in their bottom left. I'm talking about the icons that are right at the middle bottom of the screen. Nobody knows? Oh, man. Active runes? Well, I don't I don't think I have anything active, do I? Oh, hello. That's cool, man. Frost and Flame? Check your runes, correlate the icons. Oh. Stagger state, launch into glory kill. Oh yeah, okay. So then, why is one... Why is one kind of faded? Maybe it activates when I'm like in range or something? Moly. What is going on back there? I guess that's how we're reaching that area. One of the two ways. Right side, we have a secret up top. Yeah, maybe it activates when the condition is fulfilled. Exactly. Ooh. Oh! Oh! We couldn't auto-grab because our dashes didn't replenish there. All right. Hold up a second. That's a ways up there, though. Oh, I see. There it is. What's up, Coffin? How are you, man? Okay, suit-wise. Guys, uh, do we go immune to barrel explosions? 
Less frag cooldown, scatter bombs. Fire twice on grenades. Damaging and killing frozen enemies will drop health. It's not bad. Demons remain frozen for longer. Dash refills. Dash refill on glory kills. A lot of good options here. I'm kind of leaning more towards uh, thicker skin. Although, barrels haven't really been a huge problem. Hey, Bionic. Scatterbomb sounds pretty decent. It says each demon killed by it. Which means you could turn a small cluster of zombies into a carpet bomb. Let's see. So he kills the middle one. Yeah, it could be kind of cool. But it's it's only with that one frag grenade. That's the thing. Barrels leave behind some ammo. If so hear me out on this. What if we went if we went thicker skin so we don't die from barrel explosions, then they respawn. I don't know how long they take to respawn. Uh, but we could combo these two for like to help us actually. Hey Neko. Two bomb, welcome, dude. Scatter bomb super powerful for weak mobs. I just think with weak mobs, we can already kill them so easily. You know? You can re use them as recurring bombastic damage dealers. Yeah, that's kind of what I'm thinking. I'm gonna I'm gonna do this. We're gonna have regenerating barrels, and then maybe even go into this where they drop uh, ammo. We'll see. We'll see how it feels. I'm committed now. Not much I can do. Oh, oh, <laughs> my dash. My dash didn't refill. <laughs> We're cool. I really need ammo. 